Welcome to Fintech TV, I'm Remy Blair. Archeum is an encrypted supercomputer that enables secure computation on fully encrypted data. It does create a new way to handle computing and trustless interactions, allowing users to protect data while performing computations. It is also a decentralized global network that lets users protect information while unlocking new possibilities for innovation as well as collaboration across sectors. Archeum enables secure data processing as well as privacy, preserving AI models and secure enterprise collaboration to foster innovation across DeFi, finance, as well as artificial intelligence. Joining me here at the New York Stock Exchange to tell me more is Yannick Schrade, CEO and co-founder of Archeum. Thank you so much for joining me. Thanks for having me, Remy, it's a pleasure. Well, first and foremost, for our viewing audience out there, tell me why encrypted computation matters. Um, by default, nowadays, when you want to use your data, mm -hmm. you have to give up privacy, right? And so data is being processed in a way where whoever is processing that data needs to see the data. Yes. And that's a very big problem, especially when we look at AI and how that data can be exploited and used by different players. And so we are trying to overcome this problem by building our encrypted supercomputer where computations and data can be processed in a way where nobody ever has to see the data, yet we can enable way more powerful applications. And so we overcome one of those fundamental issues that we see in computing nowadays, which is that the entire internet is built on top of a lot of single points of failure and a lot of trust requirements, which moving forward into yeah, an era where data and AI become more valuable and powerful, we think um, yeah, has to be overcome. And so that's why we're building Archeum, in order to protect any data. And for viewers out there, if you could also elaborate on what real world problems that Archeum is solving. Yeah, and so um, any computation, any individual, any organization can have full privacy. That's, that's what we're solving for. And what that means is that with Archeum it becomes possible to have fully encrypted AI, fully private AI, which means you can train AI over highly sensitive encrypted data, you can use AI without ever having to expose your information. And how Archeum got started is solving the issue of privacy on top of blockchain networks, mm -hmm. which are distributed public ledgers like Solana, and those networks by default are entirely public. And so if those networks should revolutionize the financial system, there needs to be privacy in order for both individuals to adopt this technology, but also for institutionals mm -hmm. to move their, um, their activities on top of those ledgers, right? And so what becomes possible with Archeum on top of blockchain networks is, for example, dark pools, mm -hmm. which nowadays make up more than 60% of daily US spot volume. And so with Archeum, it becomes possible to have this kind of encrypted private trading, mm -hmm. encrypted private financial activities on top of blockchains, but we've expanded from that. It's not just about bringing privacy to blockchain networks, but bringing privacy through our decentralized network to any sector, to any company. And uh, speaking of company, I do want to ask you about an acquisition that took place for Archeum at the end of last year. So here we are, the first quarter of 2025. Tell us about Archeum uh, acquiring Infer and what this means for the organization. Yes, um, so as I said, we've really been starting out building privacy for blockchain networks. And meanwhile, Infer has spent nearly a decade building encrypted AI for DeFi TradFi um, and healthcare and so they've been a very well established player and the leading AI um, player for privacy in the US and, and globally and so we had this shared vision of bringing privacy to every application to everyone um, and so it made sense to come together us acquire uh, Infra and building out this encrypted supercomputer mm -hmm. where we can process any kind of computation in a fully encrypted way. And so um, it was logical to move from Infra's business model, mm -hmm. which really was um, yeah, SaaS-like business model of providing mm -hmm. confidential computing 
towards merging everything into our encrypted supercomputer, where it's basically like encrypted fiber optic cables. Mm -hmm. That's that's the way I like to think of it, um, spanning across the globe. So everybody can simply tap into this permissionless encrypted supercomputer and securely process data in a collaborative way without mm -hmm. ever having to risk it. So that really, um, this fusion, I guess, mm -hmm. of, of our both teams um, allowed us to really um, bring, bring, bring encryption forward and accelerate the space as a whole. And speaking of accelerating, I understand that Archeum has been accepted into the NVIDIA uh, Inception program. So tell us about this and what this means for your company. Yeah, so NVIDIA really is the leader in AI, I mm -hmm. think. Um, and with their Inception program, they back teams and startups that want to accelerate AI. And NVIDIA and Archeum have this shared vision of private AI. Mm -hmm. um, we've, we've seen it last week at the NVIDIA conference that private AI really is the big new thing where companies and individuals want to use AI but don't want to give up their data ownership and don't want to risk any any data leaks but at the same time they want more powerful models right and so NVIDIA has realized that and NVIDIA really focuses on the hardware side of things of building the most performant hardware for AI processes and we at Arcum focus on the software level mm -hmm. of bringing encrypted compute on top of this hardware and so that's why we are collaborating together mm -hmm. in order to bring encrypted AI to every company and individual because both the encrypted computing software and the efficient hardware are required to, to bring this vision to the world. And Yannick, for people out there who might not be as familiar with what private AI is and what this actually entails, can you tell us why it's important? It's AI that functions without ever having to see your data. Mm. And it's incredibly powerful because it's basically an encrypted black box that you can use in a secure way without ever having to risk your data, which mm -hmm. is highly important for businesses, but also for individuals, right? If you if you personally think about the amount of data you're feeding into ChatGPT and, and other platforms, right? And that's only the, the beginning where you actually manually have to interact with those systems. Apple now has introduced Apple Intelligence, mm -hmm. which is able to see all of your messages, everything that happens on your phone, right? So you want privacy for that. Yeah. And with encrypted AI, we can train AI models over sensitive encrypted data without mm -hmm. ever having to expose it. At the same time, we can use the models, which themselves can be encrypted, so you don't even know the model, um, in a way where you put data in it, you get data back, but nobody in between ever sees your data. And that's incredibly powerful if you think mm -hmm. about long-term use cases like healthcare, where you can now have your DNA be sequenced, your most sensitive information mm -hmm. as a human, right? Without any company having access to your DNA, yet you're able to get all of those medical benefits from it. So that's the way we think about it. Enabling way more powerful applications because we can use more data and more sensitive data without any risk of exploitation of that data. Mm -hmm. And finally, Yannick, I do want to ask you about your long-term vision for Archeum. So what is on the horizon when it comes to not just the short term, but five years from now, a decade from now? So I think five years from now, I really believe that Archeum will be the default platform, the default infrastructure mm -hmm. to enable encrypted private computing across all sectors. And 10 years down the line, I think what we'll see is that encrypted computing will have had a similar impact to the internet as the internet had to humanity as a whole. And so that's the future that we are at Archeum building towards. Okay, Yannick, well, thank you so much for joining me here today at the New York Stock Exchange. And thank you so much for sharing all of your insights. Thanks for having me, Remy.